Here we are back at the backyard boysenberry. So I've put in some stakes and uh, put some string across the top and tied up the canes for next year. Um, I've been picking some berries tonight. Not a whole lot, just a few here and there. Last night I picked a lot more. And uh, that's when I was able to put the supports in and the string. I'm gonna do a few more, uh, a few more canes. I got this plant tape to help the cane stay up off of the, help the new cane stay off of the old ones. There's a few berries down under here. That one's not ready yet. There's one. So, I've noticed quite a few holes in my leaves where some bugs have been eating, having themselves a nice little time eating my leaves. But I've also sprayed the grass. I mowed a couple of nights ago and sprayed the grass for bugs aphids or whatever and I haven't noticed any new holes in the leaves on the berries see there's a whole bunch right there bugs are just having a good old time eating my berry plant Anyways, thought I'd show you my handiwork with them strings. I'll probably have to do this again later in the fall because the strings will probably stretch out over time just like the wires did. Because there are some wires down here. <laughs> they just kind of fell they stretched out and under the weight of the vines of the canes they just couldn't hold up so anyways thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, we'll see you next time on the backyard boysenberry oh one more thing I had mentioned to a viewer that I was going to look for the pamphlet that Knott's Berry Farm sells, and I'll make a video of that once I find it, and I'll post that to the channel. Thanks again for watching. See you next time on the Backyard Boysenberry.